Ignites. Today is Wednesday, April 24th, 2024. We have an all period day schedule and these are your morning announcements. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. April is Autism Acceptance Month. The month is meant to be a time for uplifting autistic voices and sharing the community's joy. Autism is a developmental disability that affects the way people experience the world. Throughout the month, Night seems like to offer ways for neurotypical people and society at large to be more understanding and inclusive for autistic people. Self-advocacy is an important skill that is essentially important for autistic individuals. In order to be a great self-advocate, People first must know what their strengths are as well as what accommodations serve them the best. With that, acknowledge, with that knowledge, they can be their own best advocate with family, school, or community. College Tracks is still accepting new student registrations for class of 2025. Juniors who have registered need to schedule their new student meeting by the end of the month. Seniors, cost comparison meetings are now available during lunch and after school. Make your appointment as soon as possible. If you have decided what college you are attending, please come by the College Tracks office to update us. Any senior who, who needs to make corrections to their FAFSA, please stop by the College Tracks office during lunch to get assistance. Knights, are you ready for summer to be here? Prepare in advance and buy tickets to Six Flags. Enjoy the rides, water park, free lunch, and free parking for only $75. This special offer is open to anyone and the price is only available until May 17th through the Class of 2026 SJA fundraiser. Scan the QR code on posters around the school or see Mr. Sternman in room 2017 for more information. Don't miss out. Seniors, seniors, seniors. Did you know that your senior dues have to be paid by May 1st, 2024? It is very important that your senior dues are paid no later than May 1st, 2024. Please see Ms. Flores in the financial office to pay your dues with cash or on school cash online to pay with credit or debit cards. This is the last full week of April, and so we come to the last full game of this year's April Fools Tournament. Today in room 3204, the last two teams will compete to see who takes home this year's AFT trophies as HDMI won battles Solomon's team. If you want to see who emerges on top of this year's tourney, stop by 3204 at the start of lunch to be part of WHS history. And remember players, it is better to have buzzed and lost than to never buzz at all. Come join the Wellness Center to relax and for lunchtime coping skills groups. Every week we will find new ways to cope and de-stress using art, movement, music, writing, and many other forms of expression. We will meet every Wednesday until the end of the school year. We hope to see you soon! The weather is warmer and it's time to stock up on your summer Wheaton gear. Stop by the school store and see what's on sale. All t-shirts are only $10 while supplies last. Juniors, spice up your support by coming to our next flavorful fundraiser at Tacos Don Perez in Glenmont on April 30th from 3.30 to 8 p.m. For every purchase, Tacos Don Perez will donate a portion to our class. Just remember to show the flyer when ordering. Let's taco about a good time. Attention Knights, the class of 2026 is sponsoring DC United Night. Get your tickets to see your DC United soccer team take on Chicago Fire FC Saturday, May 25th at 7.30 p.m. at Audi Field in DC. Tickets are only $28. The team will donate $5 up, up from each ticket to the SGA. Support your class. Go Knights! Wheaton High School in Moco Cap will be having a fair for summer resources taking place on Thursday, May 9th at 6.30 p.m. in the cafeteria. We will share information about SSL hours, employment, internships, resume building, academic support, and more. Hope to see you there! Thinking of pursuing your dreams of higher education, it is not too early to begin learning about the process. Come to room 3320 on Tuesday, April 30th from 3 to 5 p.m. to hear college and career coordinator Ms. Lisa Romero provide information regarding the FAFSA process, state aid opportunities, and local scholarships. State testing begins this week, so to accommodate the needs for testing, this Thursday and Friday will be modified even in odd block days. If you are not involved in the English testing on Thursday or Friday, there will be an advisory and and other activities available for you. Those periods end at 10.30 on Thursday and 11 on Friday, with first period beginning just afterwards. And that concludes the morning announcements. I'm Jesse. And I'm Maria.